what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Motion Bring you guys another video guys. Keep in mind this is not your ordinary Fortnite gameplay tips and tricks type video that we do on the channel. As you guys can see, we're not playing Fortnite. We're actually playing H1Z1. So let me close the Fortnite application right now and open up H1Z1. Now keep in mind for all you H1Z1 fans out there. This is my very, very first time ever playing this game mode, so bear with me if it is cringy. Uh, I do still have to learn a little bit to it. I know a lot of people requested it. People keep hitting me up on Twitter. Follow me at Twitter slash Exotic Motion. And a lot of people have been hitting me up over there asking me things like, yo, have you tried H1Z1 yet? It's out on PlayStation. It's free. Try it out. So you know what? This is my very first time opening the game. Playing the game, I have no clue how the button controls work. I'm using a PS4 controller. As you guys can see, no, it is not scuff. I mean, it is scuff, but there's no back paddle, so I wouldn't consider this a scuff, but already off to start, we got some scary music playing, dude. I have no clue. No clue what I'm expecting to run into. I, I watch H1Z1 gameplays here and there every once in a while. Watching it on PC, it's a lot of fun. I mean, once you kill somebody, they can end up talking shit to you as they're dead and stuff like that, I believe. So it's definitely a lot of fun um, to watch just because you can communicate with everyone. So we'll see exactly how this is going to be. I don't think I'm going to be, look, level one, man. Exotic Motion YT level one. Um... Okay, so we could customize our character, which we're not going to worry about right now. We're going to stick stick with this female. Let's play a... Oh, dude, we can't do duos. That'd be sick if I could play with a teammate. But, all right, let's just, let's just go into a solo match. See what this is exactly about. I have no clue what I'm getting myself into. I know, I know a lot of you H1Z1 fans out there are going to watch this and you're going to be like, Oh my goodness, this is cringe. How are you a Fortnite pro if, if you're doing all this stuff? Guys, trust me. Watch my Fortnite videos. If, if you're going to critique me on my H1Z1 gameplay, watch my Fortnite videos first before you critique me on this, guys. This is going to be very, very hard. Of course, when you first start up a game, you got to get used to the sensitivity. You got to get used to the buttons. I don't know how to pick up weapons. I don't know how to shoot weapons. I don't know anything about the game when it comes to controllers. So let's see exactly how it's going to be. Oh, my goodness. Everyone is butt naked right from the start. Okay, there we go. Yo, can anyone hear me? Hello? How do people hear me? I think I gotta go to game chat. Let's go to game chat, you guys. Hello? Hi, guys. Alright, so how do you crouch? How do you punch? Circles to crouch? Oh, no. We gotta change that. Alright, let's do brightness. Let's turn the brightness up just a little bit. Uh, What is all this? Compass. Okay, okay. Master. Music volume. Let's turn the music down. Just so we can focus on everything else. Uh, what else? Mute game, audio, voice, game, chat. Okay. I think I think that's it. Oh, cool. So you can play like rock, paper, scissors. I don't know what I'm doing. I literally pushed R2 and my guy was not punching. So I hope, I hope this isn't like some weird stuff where you got to push like square to punch or anything like that or shoot. I hope it's just R2, L2. Basic console gameplay man that's all i'm hoping for again you guys this is my first game on bear with me I, I suggest you guys go try h1z1 i know fortnite is a lot of fun but it's always good to have an open mind to other games you know if you play other games and you're getting tired of fortnite one day just go ahead and jump on another game you know it's, it's okay to do that it's not like you're portraying fortnite you're still going to be there for fortnite it's just you just need a break from fortnite okay so oh automatically from the start, I'm parachuting. I don't even get to pick where I'm landing. It's foggy out, so I don't see anything. Oh my goodness. I can't see people. It, it feels like I'm playing alone. It honestly feels like there's nobody else in this lobby with me. I need to go to a house. Okay, there's a house over there. We're going to go to that house. Very, very laggy. I cannot control anything that I'm doing. I want to go over there. Go straight. Oh my goodness. My character doesn't know what's going on. Okay, so you sprint, jump, crouch. I guess you can't punch. It's not letting me punch. I'm, I'm pushing everything to punch, but I can't punch. Okay, so this is this is apparently supposed to be more realistic. Um, I'm just pushing buttons right now to see, see what anything does. Okay, okay, okay. What is this? Bandage. Okay, so I have bandages. Cool, cool. Where are the weapons at? Oh, there we go. How do you pick it up? Square, no. How do you pick it up? Oh, triangle. Okay, okay. Okay, so triangle is how you pick up weapons in the game, you guys. Oh, cool. We got third person. Oh, and we can drive vehicles. Let's go, baby. We're going to go ooh, We're gonna go to these houses up here. Let's see what's good with these houses. 
Hopefully we can find people. People are already killing each other. I already know people in this game are probably nice already. Starting out already nice. Oh, baby. Give me that crossbow. I already have that backpack. Some boots. What is this? Oh, shit. This is like a shotgun. How do I switch weapons? Um, I have a magnum. Oh, the gas! Oh, shit, the gas comes quick in this game. What is this? What do you mean? I gotta go. Can I outrun the gas? I think I can. I think I can outrun the gas. Okay, holy crap, the gas came extremely quick. I was not expecting it to come that fast. It already got me to 93 health, guys, already from the start. This game is very, very slow paced, but I probably landed like in a city that nobody else is at. I should have went to one of the bigger cities, but I have no clue what's going on right now at all. I gotta find people. How do you reload? Oh, this is a shotgun. Okay, so I have a shotgun. How do I switch weapons though? I gotta keep running. Storm's about to get me. Can't you like cut trees down in this game? Can't you cut trees down and then harvest it? Alright, I definitely got to play with somebody that's an H1Z1 fanatic. So guys, in the comment section below, if you play H1Z1 a lot, let me know in the comment section below. I need I need some help in this game. So that way we can definitely learn a little bit more than what we know. Because I don't know how to switch weapons. I have another weapon on my back, but I do not know how to switch to it. Maybe if I push... Let me just push all these different buttons. Okay, L1. L1's how you switch. We're going to get rid of this crossbow. Oh, sh... Never mind, this crossbow is nice. Oh, I hear someone. How do I switch weapons? Oh, shit! done with that game all right guys but on a real note i do want to try out h1z1 so i need i need a couple of you guys that are actually really good at the game and you can teach me uh here and there guys please hit me up in the comment section below as you guys can see in the background for those of you that are judging me like saying oh my goodness you're you're not a fortnite pro this is a solo squad gameplay right now where i'm taking on a full squad you guys are gonna see me it happen a few times in this gameplay but i just wanted to address that that whole h1z1 thing was a joke of course i'm not gonna give up on it i i just want to try it out for fun I want to get good at it just so that way when I'm playing the game I can actually do decent and have fun playing it rather than sitting there wasting my time and if any of you guys that are subscribed over at Twitch and you are invited to the Discord and you're in our Discord, all you got to do is let me know in the Discord if you guys are trying to play H1Z1 because I am trying to play just a little bit to get here and there. Now, don't worry. I'm not giving up Fortnite at all, you guys. This is literally just whenever, say, there's downtime on Fortnite or anything is going on with Fortnite servers where I can just do something else. So that's when I'm going to actually be playing H1Z1 and stuff like that because it's something new. And, of course, I love the whole Battle Royale scene. And, uh, guys, think about this. When the Call of Duty Black Ops 4 comes out i'm definitely going to be trying out the battle royale scene in there so it's definitely good to get used to other battle royale games rather than just sticking with fortnite because fortnite is a unique game and this is why a lot of us love it because there's building and stuff like that but all these other ones where you don't have building to rely on it's going to be extremely hard so i want to get good at stuff like that but guys everyone that came out to the live stream last night thank you guys so much we averaged like 120 viewers last night which is insane you guys it's so much love and support over at twitch.tv slash exotic motion i i mean it a lot so for that thank you guys so much we're actually doing another giveaway saturday yes that's right tomorrow i'm live streaming from four to eight o'clock and we're doing another giveaway you guys so make sure to stay tuned for that i wanted to do the keemstar a little tournament that he had going on i tried getting into it i i tweeted out to umg gaming and stuff like that but nothing happened because i i think i honestly think the whole how it works is you got to know people in the system in order to get into the games but guys with that being said i hope you guys come out to the live stream on saturday for the subscriber giveaway and i'll see you guys then peace